Next, Einstein Forum, held in Dakar, Senegal, brought together the world's best and brightest scientists and policymakers to discuss the future of science on the continent. Fifteen laureates, Africa's youngest and brightest in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, were chosen to present their research during the forum. Organizers are hopeful that this is just the beginning of scientific advancement and collaboration on the continent. We want people to look at Africa and to work with Africa as a contributor to the global world of science. Specifically, we want to do that through our events, the Next Einstein Forum Global Gatherings, which are meetings that bring together some of the leading thinkers from Africa and the rest of the world with a focus on young people and a focus on women in the presence of policymakers and knowledge-based enterprise to be that place where the leading thinkers can meet and actually do things together. We want to work on policy and we want to build a scientific community in Africa um, on the global stage. The forum kicked off on International Women's Day, at which time members of the professional sciences made it clear that within STEM development, gender equality is a goal that everyone should be after. There's been much talk about it this morning. Empa engaging and empowering women in all fields of scientific endeavor, not only research, but entrepreneurship, training, um, and as well as trailblazing research and innovation. Those lead to applications and commercialization uh, through the creation of uh, eventually successful companies. Of the 15 laureates chosen, six of them were women. One woman scientist among them spoke about her journey in becoming one of Africa's elite scientists under 40 years old. I did not have uh, any kind of um, dissuasion from pursuing a, a scientific field because I was a woman. I mean, it just didn't even come up. But I am aware, I know that we live in a society and a culture where it's still often the case where girl, girl children and young women are dissuaded from pursuing those fields based on preconceived notions of what what a scientist is. And I think that's another key role that um, the Next Einstein Forum can play in showcasing what actually what the face of scientists in Africa is. Yeah. The next Next Einstein Forum is scheduled for 2018 in Rwanda, but until then, established and aspiring scientists alike are encouraged to use the tools and connections discussed in these forums to inspire future generations to come. This is Mel Bailey for Africa 54, Dakar, Senegal.